Hey guys, Silence Seo here. Welcome back to another Uta Macross update video. As you can tell, we are on the official Uta Macross wiki page to check out all the information for the month of August. Now, a majority of this information has already been announced during the Uta Macross SP broadcast earlier this week. Uh, of course, there's other information from the Air Walkure broadcast and of course, Makutoma uh, broadcast last night. So, um, if you guys don't know what we are going to talk about, please check out my previous video regarding the Uta Macross SP broadcast and of course check out the um, Facebook page and Instagram page um, for all the other Macross content as well. So thank you guys so much for all the um, love and support on the Facebook page and of course the Instagram page which recently just reached um, 30 followers or rather 31 followers <laughs> thanks to uh, uh, one of the uh, local Macross fans in Singapore Fuzz, you know who you are <laughs> so <laughs> uh, then of course let's break down all the new information within the wiki page right now for the month of August so let's scroll down and take a look so the first thing you can tell here this was mentioned in the SP broadcast um, The all the information regarding the anniversary celebration so if you want to take a quick look all of these have been mentioned during the SP broadcast already so I just scroll through and roughly brief so this whole bunch of Japanese hacks here basically is the schedule for the month of August uh, regarding login bonus missions and of course gachas so as usual login bonuses will give you all the singing stones uh, super dimension tickets um, star fragments for your rare up star and of course large episode ops which is good for unlocking costumes um, then of course we've got all the gachas for the beginners and of course um, there's the five star guarantee and above four copies gacha pool and of course from all the free pools you also can possibly attain a six star episode plate and maybe evolve your seven star episode plates you know, and of course, there's a, a gacha for costume points only. Then, of course, it seems like we're getting a second round of Nyan Nyan service missions. So, if you guys technically have been playing the first round of Nyan Nyan service missions um, for the month of July, you would have technically pulled out your first copy of the um, brand new Nyan Kuji exclusive episode played with the cheerleader team. Um, so yeah, then of course, since there's a second round, there's going to be more tickets for us, especially for free-to-play players. Um, there is a chance that you might get the episode play pool evolve. Um, did I say pool? Episode play <laughs> evolve uh, to its six staff glory. If not, well, there's always the discounted singing snow packs that's currently going on. Um, if I'm not wrong, I think today is the last day for the first and second round um, anniversary eve discounted packs. So if you have the money for it, please go purchase those packs before they expire. And of course, we have two more rounds of discounted packs coming up for the month of August. So guys, let me know in the comment section down below how much money have you thrown <laughs> into this game so far for the... For, I mean, for the month of July and August, uh, are you ready to, you know, burn your cash away to try and attain the brand new Mirai on costumes, and of course whatever costumes that's coming out for the month of August, and of course there is the missions and challenges for rare up star fragments. We already mentioned this in the SP broadcast. Uh, summer tickets and of course Nyan Nyan Bingo missions. Uh, I will probably create a video um, for the mission requirements for these bingo cards um, if I have the time or you know if not I'll just post it up on Facebook with all the translated information as usual. Um, then of course we have the exchange for the Nyan Kuji episode plates also mentioned in the SP broadcast and all the other stuff here. Um, you know that's in Japanese text so I won't go through in details for, for these informations because it's already been mentioned before um, as we know the first event of the month is the brand new five unit uh, performance for Mirai On and of course the two seven star episode plates are the costumes de designed by Capcom illustrator Mita Chisato uh, if you don't know where these costume designs come from they are actually the cover 
um, costume designs for the Mirai on single um, so that's pretty nice and of course finally we're getting the five unit performance we've been asking for um, so then all these costume designs we already know because they were mentioned in the SP broadcast so Cheryl and Ranka are getting crossover costumes from Valkyrie's set of costume wardrobes uh, <laughs> and you know Ranka's color palette is definitely the most obvious one it's her Seikan Hiko colors um, but Cheryl sadly in enough it's not really designed to look like any of her costume colors instead it's pretty similar to what actually mi uh, Mirage wore <laughs> so yeah it's actually Mirage's color palette instead of Cheryl's um, so that's pretty interesting then of course we get the illustration for the Red Boss exclusive episode plate that you can get from the Chaos Exchange during that time period so it features Mikumo and Ranka in their futuristic costume designs that we've seen before and of course this is the most interesting one and strangely enough I was hoping Basara to wear Freya's costume design but instead it is Kaname's design in a red shirt so we don't see the iconic yellow for Kaname uh, so strangely enough um, I guess Min Mei is going to be one wearing Freya's costume because like I said I was really hoping for Basara to wear Freya's costume design and in fact I would have liked it to be the skirt design <laughs> Because of this load screen in Uta Cross, I would have loved to see him dance in the frilly dress for Freya. Um, it has been a thing for Basara to be goofing off in Uta Cross uh, ever since they introduced the uh, Megane designs for all the different divas. Like, if you use Basara to perform Ranka's um, Ninjin Loves You, yeah, he'll get the carrot. Um, design for his Megane so glasses yeah then of course Milane wearing Maki Maki's costume design which seems to work pretty okay but you know considering that twin tails might make Milane look a bit strange <laughs> but I think it I, I think it fits her kind of <laughs> it's just that she's a lot skinnier than uh, Maki Maki well I'm not talking about her boobs but you know <laughs> <laughs> She's more slender uh, compared to Maki Maki. Uh, Makina has a lot nicer curve line. <laughs> okay, enough of that. Um, so moving on with all the information, we've got the repeat event, um, which is the second event for the month. So featuring Cheryl, which is of course hinting to the fact that Cheryl's uh, Makina crossover costume. No, not Makina. Mikumo. Ah. Uh, when there's character names with the same starting initial letters. Oh, it gets confusing. <laughs> okay, so yes, Cheryl is the main diva for the second event of the month. And of course, uh, we know for that, um, that her crossover costume is going to be the featured first gacha for that time period. And then of course, Ranka wearing Reina's costume will be the featured gacha for the Red Boss event. Basara's birthday step up gacha. So guys, um, finally, if you have already voted for both divas' birthday, um, you know, featured episode plays, you can tell here on the second image. These are the number one top picks. So Mikomo and Basara step up birthday gachas. So there's a lot of stuff coming out this month, which requires a lot of singing stones. So guys, unless you can afford to or are able to purchase singing stone packs from this game due to all the um, you know credit purchases uh, issues that you know either Apple users are facing or Android users are facing across the world you probably won't be able to celebrate as much as you want but you know guys if you guys are free to play players make sure you use the amount of singing stones that you have saved up saved up for your favorite um, divas even if it's Basara you know try and get the stuff that you really want uh, of course you know the basic stuff like trying to attain costume points for all the new costumes available well except for the seven star ones of course um, then I think you're pretty much good to go yeah so that's it guys that's all the information I have for you 
for the month of August, well, from the wiki page, of course, <laughs> there's always some other stuff that they will dump into the game that is not mentioned anywhere uh, eventually. So, guys, that's it. Let me know your thoughts about everything in the comment section down below as usual. And, of course, do all the wonderful good stuff. Like, share, subscribe for this video. And, of course, the YouTube channel. Uh, follow me, like, and uh, on Instagram and Facebook for all things Utama Cross and of course other stuff that I love that I share on my YouTube channel like Monster Hunter Stories 2 and Pokemon Cafe Mix and of course the Nonary games that we are trying to complete um, as of late. <laughs> Until then guys, I'll see you guys soon. Bye!